Hello, good morning children. Welcome to our math class. Are you ready for the math class children? Let's start our class. In the previous class, we have learnt how to represent a number on an abacus. The place value concept and expanded form. Are you ready with your math book, pencil and eraser children? Yes. Now look at the screen. All of you open page number 18. Here the first question we have is write the place value of the underlined digit. Here we have the number 128. In this which digit is underlined? It is 2. 2 is in which place? It is in tens place. So we get 2 tens. 2 tens is equal to 20. 2 tens is written in green box and 20 is written in orange box. What is the next number we have? It is 163. Now in 163 which digit is underlined? It is 3. 3 is in which place? It is in ones place. So if the digit is in ones place, write the digit as it is. So write 3 in the green box. That is 3 ones. Write 3 ones in the green box and 3 in the orange box. Similarly, you do the third sum. Now, the second question we have is write the expanded form of the following numbers. What is the first number given? It is 133. For that 133, first write the place values. Always write the place values from your right to left. Above the number, write with small letters ones, tens and hundreds. Write short forms of ones, tens and hundreds. When you are writing the place value, always start from the highest place value. Here the highest place value we have is 100. So start from hundreds place. How many hundreds we have? It is 100. So write 100 plus how many tens we have? 3 tens. 3 tens is equal to 30. So write 30 plus 3 ones. 3 ones means write 3. Hence we get 100 plus 30 plus 3. This is the expanded form for number 133. Next, what is the next number we have? It is 105. First, write the place values above the number. That is 1s, 10s and 100s. Uh, remember, always write the place value from your right to left. So, above 5, write 1s. That is O. Above 0, you write tens, that is T. And above 1, you write hundreds, that is H. So here we have 105. Write the expanded form for this children. We have to start from the highest place value. What is the highest place value here? Here it is 100. So 100 plus 0 tens. 0 tens is nothing but 0, right? 0 plus 5 ones, that is 5. 100 plus 0 plus 5. Similarly, you try the next one, children. Now, let's go for the third question. That is, find the numbers. Here, in this question, they have given the expanded form of a number. You have to find out the number. But in the previous one, that is the question 2, 
they have given the number we have written the expanded form the same reverse is in the case of question 3 now they have they have given 700 7 plus 50 plus 100 now start from the ones place write only the digits write only the digits that is write 7 in ones place 5 in tens place 1 in hundreds place remove zeros and write down only the digits now the second question is what is the expanded numbers we have 4 80 and 100 write 4 in ones place 8 in tens place and 1 in hundreds place similarly you try the third sum children now let's go to the fourth question that is write the numbers for the expanded forms here they have given the expanded form of a number you have to write down the number first one is 100 plus 30 plus 0 100 plus 30 plus 0 here in 100 in 100 what is the digit you have to underline 1 underline 1 in tens place 30 is there so underline 3 and 0 in one's place I write down as it is so we get the number 130 130 now the second question 100 plus 0 plus 7 come on children which number we have to underline which digit we have to underline in 100 underline 1 here 0 in ones plus 7 so 1 0 7 that is 107 we get the number 107 and the last one 100 plus 10 plus 2 we have 100 plus 10 plus 2 now which digit you have to underline in 100 underline 1 in 10 underline 1 and 2 underline 2 so 1 1 2 that is 112 did you understand children yes very good here are few worksheets write down in rough book one by one neatly and solve the sums children all of you look at this worksheet children the first question we have is write each expansion in the form of numbers first we have 500 plus 80 plus 3 what number we get it is 583 583 now the second question is 700 plus 70 plus 7 what number we get come on tell it is 777 7 7 7 now the second question write the following numbers in expanded form as given in example let's take the number 524 here how many hundreds we have children it is 5 we have 5 hundreds write 5 in hundreds box now how many tens we have we have 20 tens so write 2 in tens box and how many ones we have we have 4 ones write 4 in 
once box here is the second worksheet children the question we have is write the numbers in the expanded form you have to write the number in the expanded form in the previous worksheet they have given the expanded form you have written the number here they have given the number you have to write down the expanded form the first question we have is 562 562 see how many hundreds we have it is 500 right 500 plus leave finger space and write children neatly and how many tens we have six tens so write 60 plus how many ones we have two ones right two so we get 500 plus 60 plus 2 now the second question 937 937 How to write nine hundred thirty-seven in expanded form? Come on, tell children. It is nine hundred plus thirty plus seven. Very good, children. You write down neatly in a rough book. Enter all the questions in a rough book neatly. Leave a line and write, children, and practice these questions. children you need to learn the tables daily as they are very important for quick maths already we have started learning tables so by this time you might be knowing up to fifth table perfectly today you learn sixth table Let's continue our class children. Thank you for listening. Have a wonderful day.